Hey guys, what's going on? Today we're going to be playing uh, my last two placement matches. Um, hopefully everything goes good. I have won every, every, every single one of my placement matches so far. And hopefully these two are easy too. I'm just going to skip to the end of this one because I don't want to show you. And then I'll come back for the last game. Okay. Okay, so it's 3-4 with 50 seconds left. I score. It's 5-3. This is the eighth game. After this one, we'll have one more. Actually, I think this is the best season I have had due to my placement matches. I've been facing a lot of um, Plat 2 and Plat 3 players, and I have beaten them. Like I said, I think I have won all of my placement matches. That was a bad play right there for me. But somehow he didn't score. I shouldn't be up in the air right now, but, you know, I'm, I'm just doing whatever I can score here. You will find out as, more, as, as you play more 1v1s that if they're losing, they'll do way more mistakes like in the last minute of the game and then it, it can be very easy to capitalize on your on your winning streak already all right and uh yeah so this is the last match this guy is from his card that i saw in the preview and the way that he was uh the way that he went for kickoff i can tell he's actually better than the last guy He's either unranked or he's like plat 3. Or he's probably diamond, who knows. Good save from him. Turning on this. I'm just boost starving him at this point. Weird shot from him. Oh yeah, one thing I wanted to talk about is that... As, uh, when I started my placement matches, I was going to t against uh, only Octanes, right? But then as I as I improved and I went up, like as I started winning games, I started going against uh, Phoenix, a lot of Phoenix. I don't know if it was because... Okay. That was a close one from him. I don't want to be mean, but... I don't know what happened there. But yeah, a lot of Phoenix. I don't know if uh, Phoenix is back in the on people's mind. I know Phoenix went up in price really recently for some reason. For me, uh, for me, I don't really like the Phoenix because it feels like it feels fat and heavy. I like the Octane better because it it feels fast and it feels like light. It feels like uh, you can you have more control over it. He's, uh, I don't know what he's doing right now. Maybe he's having a, a rough time. I could have scored there, but I turned too late. This guy is really doing the most, you know? I could have scored there again, but I didn't. Nice boomer. Hopefully I can clear this. He got another shot, and I could have saved that if I probably would have gone more, like if I would have gone more to the left. Kick off again, so it's 1-1 one, one with three minutes left. Oh, I thought I could have scored there. So far, he's, he's playing pretty good. He's just a little, I thought he scored there. He's just playing a little weird, you know? Like, he'll play passive, and I don't know where he'll just go super aggro on the ball. He has all these shots to uh, to score, but he's just missing them, dude. Maybe this is his first game of the day. His shots are not on point. He can score that. Again, too slow to the ball. I can just boom this, and he'll probably just go in. Yeah. Most of the times those work. Yeah, I saw that he went for like he tried to get some boost, so I just 
I just boomed it straight into the net and he didn't have enough time to recover. Another another shot. Nice kickoff goal right there. 3 1. It's looking like I'm gonna win so far, but you, you never know. Like when it comes to 1v1s, I have played 1v1s games that I have come back like in one minute from like three goals down. Like I don't do this, but a lot of players do this. Like they start playing careless when they think they're gonna win. So they uh, they start playing, in other words, they start playing dumb. Another, another goal. He could have saved that too. I could have made it easier for myself, but I don't know why I did that. Two minutes left still, and I'm up three goals. If we don't get extremely... Okay, he scored it. I literally bumped him into that. That's crazy. Oh, yeah, he's also a PC player. I have faced uh, a lot of PC players recently. Ever since, like, um... Because I mostly play 1v1s at night. I guess, like, not a lot of... Because most consoles are kids that play on console and... And like I guess adults have PCs I guess so it's mostly like PC players at night or people that are online at, at, at night mostly in twos and ones but again I'm pretty sure I'm gonna get like um maybe plat two division four because last season I think I got uh, my highest was a uh, plat three division one Yeah, I think that's what it was. Pat 3, Division 1. There's a minute left. It doesn't look like he's going to win. I mean, but anything can happen. I'm going to leave that for him because it's dropping right on his head. Ooh, nice one. If he, if he would have kept it closer to his car, he would have scored there. And then we would have been in a, sti on a, in a sticky situation. Over his head, and that should be another goal. And that should be GG's. That should be GG's. He's not skipping. I think he's forfeiting. Yep. GG's, GG's, and he dips. All right, so let's see uh, what rank I get. Okay, I got plat three. Plat three, division three. That's really nice. I'm pretty, I'm pretty sure I'm going to make it a diamond one this season if I actually keep up the grind. Because it only, it only takes like uh, one or two games just to knock you straight down. Especially in uh, in 1v1s. Well guys, thanks for watching. Hopefully y'all learned something about playing ones. And hopefully y'all have a good day. Bye.